Richard, this is a call I bet you get a lot. You've got a vanity up in a bathroom and the water is either not draining at all or it's draining very slowly. Pretty common complaint. A lot of times people brush the hair and a lot of hair gets down in the side of the drain. Underneath the sink there's a couple of places where you can get uh, hair and things caught. Here at the top or in the trap. Let me show you over here actually. It'll be easier to see. This is the first place I would look. Here's the sink and there's a thing called the pop-up assembly. The pop-up assembly, here it is here. You'd have a lift lever and when you did, it would let the stopper go up right. or down to hold water in the sink. Okay. A lot of times what happens is these linkages loosen a little bit. So people don't realize that they don't really have a stoppage. It's just that the stopper is down so low yeah. that you think you have a stoppage. It's coming up. It's right. coming up just a tiny Correct. bit. So you need to make sure it comes up full and then goes down full and the other, it's not really a stoppage. Right. The next place to look though is right here. If hair gets down through that stopper, you need to take apart the pop-up assembly. Now if you have a stoppage, you've got to be careful. When I loosen this nut, any water that's above it is going to come out so you put a bucket underneath. So now I'd loosen this. Okay. Yeah. So just pull that stopper. Right. So now this actually comes okay. out. So Look now, so now that often comes out and it is unbelievable. It's covered in hair and toothpaste and all kinds of stuff. Let me look at it. There's a ton of places for That's things right. to get hung right. up on it. And this actually sits in inside the, the drain huh. stream, so that can actually catch a bunch of stuff. Okay. So you clean them all up and stuff like that. But that might not be enough. It may be that there's a stoppage down below right here. Right, and so below that drain stop, we've got the peat There's always trap. a trap. I mean, that's a perfect place for something to settle and get hung up. Yeah, right? a lot of times these Q-tips and air, air cleaners and little pieces can sit in that trap and it'll just catch everything it can. Right. So, if that's the case, they make these little handy little things that you could try to do it yourself to come down through here and with this clear trap, hmm. you can really see how, you know, this comes come here, we can try to clear it, catch it, right. and draw it back. And if that was hair or something, we'd be able to get it, get it back, okay? Every house should have some version of this. This is a drain snake, okay? The way it works is it advances this way, and then the, there's all kinds of variations of it, but now we're gonna feed this down. Just hold back against it. Sure. Region. So now we come down to the trap, and now if I turn, turn this, see how it goes right here. Oh, now, if yeah. that had something, that would clear the stoppage, right. and draw it back. Right. This clear trap is great to see it. So okay. in this case, we've gotten through this um, the stop way right clear. here. That's clear. The P trap is clear. That's clear. And you can actually keep going to the other trap. Correct. Point. And the, but if it isn't there, that means we now go to the next place where you go. This normally goes into the wall. And now you hope that that drain snake goes down to where the stoppage <laughs> might be. But there's also a vent connected to it. So you can drive yourself crazy. All of a sudden you hear the thing, the snake's going in the wall, clanging around, and, and you hope that it goes this way. Because we know the stoppage is not Correct. there. If you really want to go crazy, sometimes you've got double sinks. A sink and a sink. You try to run the snake through here and it comes right out through the other sink. We don't have any stoppages over no. here. So let's clear, that st let's clear that one. So here's our snake. So now this one has the stopper removed so it can come straight down and we know it's not in the pop-up assembly. So I can feed it in, advance it, might be through the trap. Sort of pushing and turning simultaneously. Yeah. And you don't want to put too much snake out because it'll splash all around and you won't be having to have enough torque to drive it down through. Alright, so here we are, we're at this, I can feel it now, a little resistance. See oh, it? yep, there, there you go. There it goes. Whoa. Well, there you go. All right. No doubt about so it. now, always clean your wire when you bring it back. Feed it back, and let's see. Oh. What color is your hair? Uh, I'm a true red hair. <laughs> well, that's not my hair. <laughs>